Hi guys, this is the Astrox Next Stage Review. You can find this racket on the market for close to £100. The recommended retail price is £120. The deal that you're getting with the amount of technology and performance you're getting out of this racket is astounding. Let's check it out in more detail. The Astrox 100ZX was released as a cheaper alternative to the 100 series with the ZZ, a £260 recommended retail price racket, being the flagship. The 100ZX offered such great value, it was a very, very tempting choice for most players. But now, for the introduction of the Astrox Next Stage, the word value now has a different meaning. Nanomesh Neo allows the Next Stage and the 100ZX to have great power and control at the same time. The Astrox Next Stage frame is made from high modulus graphite, which is found in most high-end brackets, tungsten and VDM. VDM is vibration damping mesh and it eliminates unwanted vibrations when you're hitting, giving a stable feel. And the graphite shaft is where you can find Nanomesh Neo on the Next Stage, as opposed to on the 100 ZX is found in the frame. This racket is the 4U G5 variant. So 4U is lighter than the 3U rackets and G5 is a smaller grip size than G4 rackets. The Astrox Next Stage has a medium flex shaft, which is forgiving for players who are just developing their technique or just want an easier racket to use on their shoulders and pair together with the famous Astrox rotational generator system with the counterweights on the top, middle and bottom of the frame, you get a super powerful smash. It's nuts. For a racket that is only £100 in most places, the amount of power and stability that you get is unparalleled with any other rackets in this price range that I've tried before. You seriously need to have a try in order to understand it. This racket also has the Energy Boost Cap Plus, which is found in the Astrox 100s. The Energy Boost Cap is quite special in the way it helps your stability. Facing the racket forward, you've got an upside down U shape to help the shaft flow in one direction. But when you turn the shaft sideways, it's an upside down U shape to prevent the shaft from twisting. This maximizes your overall stability. Looking at the frame of the racket, when you touch the top and the bottom of the frame, it is quite sharp to give you that aerodynamic cut across the air, the speed that you need to dominate the court. And when you touch the middle of the frame, it's quite blunt. It reminds you of the traditional aero box frame that is found on most Jonix rackets, which is a hybridization of powerful play and speedy play. This is all implemented in such a manner to give you an addictive sweet spot feel and sound that you don't find on any other rackets at 100 pounds. The Astrox Next Stage is actually more head heavy than the ZX. The ZX also has a stiffer shaft than the Next Stage. This overall makes the ZX more control orientated and the Next Stage more power orientated. But if you want something that has better maneuverability overall, then these head heavy rackets might not be for you. Then check out the Even Balance series, Arcsaber series and Headlight series, Nano Flare series. Those have great options at a variety of different price ranges. The Astrox Next Stage, like the 100ZX, is made in Taiwan. And Yonex ensures that all their products, despite it being made in Taiwan or Japan, have the same high level of quality control. So this is just another Yonex racket, as you know. The closest feeling racket to the Astrox Next Stage, in my opinion, has to be the Astrox 77 and the 77 Pro. Those are much more expensive rackets, and this is not far off compared to those. Thank you so much for watching this video and always tuning in onto this channel, even after a long time. If you have any suggestions for any new videos, just drop them in the comment section down below. Make sure to have post notifications on to not miss my uploads every single Sunday. I'll be mixing badminton content and my work slash education content on this channel so I can get to know you guys a bit better. As with all head heavy rackets, it's some. Oh.